Yo, what's going on, guys? Your boy Ooze back in once again. And this time around, we have a Kaiju number eight official trailer number four that we're going to be reacting to today. So I've missed out on, I guess, the first three trailers. <laughs> That's completely i guess on me because i i honestly forgot that this anime was coming this year i mean i didn't forget but you know i like wasn't like at the front of my head i guess if that makes sense there's been a lot of things that has been going on in life and just in the industry as as, as a whole so kaiju number eight coming as an anime this year this april actually at the time of this recording this is like we're like a month out this is a series that i've actually been following since it started in shonen jump i have to say I have a thing for new shows that I can just tell when they're going to be hits and that they're going to take off in the coming years whenever they do get their respective animes. And Kaiju number eight, when that John dropped, I read that first chapter. Nah, scratch that. Let's go back a little bit further. When I heard about the premise of the show being about Japan is almost like overrun by kaiju and they have the, a, an actual defense force that is designed to take them out alongside having like a cleaning crew to take you know care of all of the the destruction and all that all the stuff that all these kaiju leave behind so it adds like some sort of realistic element to it you have to wonder like after all these crazy fights in like a lot of series not just with monster movies and all that stuff but it's just like i wonder how, mu how much time it does take to clean up like wreckage like that you know what i'm saying when i found out that this was a basically a godzilla manga i would that's all i needed to really know so let me not jibber jabber too much um i just want to get right into it so let's do it <laughs> oh <oof. laughs> uh, hibino Wow. <laughs> this looks like it's gonna be such a freaking hit. Animation look mad clean. Ooh. Oh, oh, yes. I'm not really sure how about I feel about the song so far. They might grow on me, but right now, I'm not. It's not really hitting. I'm not gonna lie. <sighs> Holy shit! Uh. Oh man. Wow. It looks like it's it's going to cover a decent amount of the story. So I'm going to play it back in slow motion so that I can like talk and you guys have something else to look at because I'm sure like looking at me talking is probably, you know, boring or something. So without spoiling anything uh, for the anime only heads out there in the world that are looking forward to watching this. Um, I'm not going to spoil anything at all, but the only thing that I will say is as someone that has read and like I mentioned, I've kept up with this series for, you know, its lifetime. It's still going um, at the time of this video. I'm only but some odd chapters behind, so I'm not terribly behind, but I'm pretty confident that this series is covering content that I've already read, which to be fair, it's been a while, so a lot of this stuff that we're all going to be experiencing for the first time will almost be like a refresher, but in a sense, because sometimes my memory is a pretty shit, I forget things, so it will almost be like I am, you know, seeing 
all of this for the first time. I'm sure there will be some moments where I'll be like, oh, yeah, this is when this happens, this is when that happens. But there's been so many great moments out of this show, and I feel like a lot of people are going to get into this. So the trailers, they do reveal a lot. So I guess I, I might as well just tell you guys that much. I mean, it's obvious this Kafka, he's the main character. He looks like he turns into some sort of a kaiju himself. So what makes this show really interesting, as you see right here, there's like a defense force of trained soldiers that when they wear those suits, they are like superhuman so that they're able to fight against the kaiju because obviously they're trying to kill them all so that they can protect humanity so it's like similar to attack on titan in that respect and i'm not gonna lie side note i will i have gone out on a limb to say that this show may fill the void of not having attack on titan anymore but we shall see this it's gonna hit a lot different this is way more shonen than attack on titan um was i mean i don't think it really was in the first place now that I, I say that out loud but this has a lot of great action a lot of cool characters and basically with the main character he they give it away they he basically turns into a kaiju while he's also a part of this new defense force and what makes it funny is that he's almost like a loser type character where he's not the strongest but he has a friend who he mentions in the trailer like he he wants to be able to feel like he can stand next to her as an equal um so there's that whole dynamic going on with the show and at the same time there's a lot of very cool characters like i had mentioned that um i'm sure a lot of people are going to be fans of and there's a lot of really cool action drama and really dope fights i could tell you that right now from what my memory is giving me from what i'm trying to pull right now i'm telling y'all the art in the manga is great but from just seeing this trailer i have very good confidence that this is gonna be a banger is gonna hit and i'm sure that a lot of y'all back home are going to love this show i'm gonna call that at least right now it might not fill the void of attack on time because attack on time is pretty big but it will definitely feel like it's gonna have a very big presence so let me know what you guys thought about this kaiju number eight trailer are you guys interested if you've never heard of it before or are you someone that's been following the manga or you're at least aware of it and now that you've seen this in fluid motion you're more excited to check it out for yourselves when it does drop i wanna say april 13th and that's JST. So I'm pretty sure it comes out like either Friday or Saturday morning for us here in the United States. Definitely check out the like Google for like how, what the time conversion is for wherever you might be in the world. And as always, make sure you are liking and subscribing to the channel to support because I know sometimes when we do these reaction videos, the videos get demonetized like mad quick because for whatever reason, especially with anime, they just love to pull copyright and they don't know how all of this fair use stuff works. It does at least help when you guys are dropping a comment, giving the thumbs up and subscribing because it at least lets me know that you guys are watching the video and you got something out of it i guess speaking of comments let me know like i was saying before what you guys thought of kaiju number eight and if you're excited for it and what you're looking forward to seeing and uh let me know if you're looking forward to seeing godzilla make sure you guys are taking care of yourselves may the power protect you keep it locked loaded right here on the channel stay safe stay clean and stay the hell inside and i'll see y'all next time